Well, it's Tuesday morning, a shade after 10. I just got a call from the guru. He's headed to Thimble Beach. I was going to join him, but I'm thinking about going to East Beach, where I said I was going to go yesterday. So I think that's what I'll do. And then we'll get a report to see how he did. John went to Thimble Beach last night, and then he went to the land of Nada, and both were void of any targets of any consequence. So I'm headed to East Beach. I'll give you a report maybe later when I talk to Kenny. Stand by. I changed my mind. I'm going to Thimble Beach with Kenny. Thimble Beach in East. Down by the hotel. I'm going to try this other new dragger today too. See how it does. I mean, I know it'll do okay. I lent the other one to that new guy, Danny. Let him try it. He didn't have a dragger, so we'll get a report from him here soon. See how it goes. Well, you can see it's a nice day in the neighborhood. You can see all the ships are anchored from the bow with the tide going out. I know you can't see him, but the guru is right down there on the edge of the water. Stand by. Some kind of sandpipers. Look at them beaks on them. It's about uh, mid-60s. It'll be a nice day. Well, the first target, two scoops deep, is one bigger dime. There's a nice drop off here about knee deep. Right off the drop off right here. And the tide's still going out a little ways. Hey, we got a hit here. A low hit. Stand by. Nice, Takita. Target number three is a gray matter. Pyramid gray matter. Got a kind of a medium sound here. I don't know what this is. But it sounds pretty good. Stand by. Not foreign coins, it's 10 cent centunes or some damn thing. Republic of Stand by for later. I think it's a 10 cent French coin. Republic of Frances. Frances. Pretty cool little coin. I don't think I ever found any French coins before. You can see I'm like in a little slew. There's an outer bar right now. As I get further down, the bar actually dries right out. You see it? it dries our bone right now. I'm kind of in the middle. Some targets, but mostly junk. Pull tabs and, you know, stuff like that. Aluminum. It's about pecker deep right here.
You can see it's right up to the right up to it. Got more aluminum. Well, there's a guru. Now, where in the hell he came from, I don't know. He must have dropped out of the sky. Because I've been in this one spot for an hour, and he ain't been nowhere near in sight. And that's where you go on at right there. That's the parking spot. Unless he just came back. Because he wasn't here 10 minutes ago when I was going the other way. Let's we'll see what he's doing. Stand by. The guru. All right, show me the yellow. You got a hundred holes in this place. What's that? You got a hundred holes dug in here. But most of your targets are right along in here. I can see a thousand holes you dug. Yeah. I haven't got anything much. Just a little bright. Uh, I guess it's a bright show. I got a laser pointer. Yeah. Some oh, caps and some aluminum, a lot of aluminum. Yeah. A couple of coins, that's about it. No, I got uh, no quarters. I ain't got a quarter either. I got dimes. Maybe I threw that thing away. Oh, here it is on this side. First target I got out here. And after that one, nothing is downhill all the way. Well, where'd you go? Because you weren't here a half hour ago. I went down to the thing there. Oh yeah, a butterfly on it. Cool. Yeah, it's got a big hairpin. Oh, it's a hairpin. That's what it is here for hair. Yeah. Finally some bling. It's a earring. Stud earring. Look like somebody going on a cruise. What's it? Funny earring, you saw that? I finally hit it with two quarters. A dime and that foreign coin, whatever that is. And one gray matter.